Welcome to another video in our Tableau Certified Data Analyst Exam Prep Series. Today we're going to take a look at some additional bonus questions which will cover domains 1 through 4. Alright, let's jump straight to question number 1. For this question, you need to think about the steps you would take to create a Gantt chart. More specifically, you need to describe how you would create a Gantt chart which lists projects and their duration. You will definitely see these types of questions on the exam, so make sure you can describe the steps you would take in order to create a pie chart, a bar chart, a scatter plot, a histogram, a line chart, and a map. For question number two, let's say you have a field called budget variance, which contains values for the variance in your budget. One of those values is negative seven, but you want to return the absolute value of that number. What would be the best calculation to achieve this? So we're looking for the function that's going to return the absolute value of any given number. And the correct answer here is D. Let's take a look at question number three. Let's say you want to align two axes in a dual axis chart to use the same scale. What option should you choose? In order to use the same scale in a dual axis chart, we need to synchronize our axes. So the answer here is C. Question number four is a little bit more tricky. So here you need to create a table calculation to remove the years with incomplete data from the table below. So we need to choose the correct calculation and specify how to set up the filter. So first of all, you need to know what these two functions are used for. And you also need to know how table calculations work or how changing the scope is going to affect the values being computed. So to help you answer this question, try to recreate this specific example using the sample superstar data set. Here we have another tricky question related to table calculations. So we're given a table and we need to be able to describe what will happen to this table if we were to change our compute by option to table down as opposed to table across. The answer here is A. And if you struggled in answering this question, I would highly recommend that you recreate it on your end and try to play around by changing the scope because you will definitely see a good number of these questions on the exam. All right, so here we have a question related to Tableau Prep Builder. And the question is asking us which cleaning operations are available in an input step. Now, you will not see any sophisticated questions related to Tableau Prep Builder, but you may see something like this. So in this case, we actually need to know which cleaning operations are available in each step type. So I found this nice little summary table that I think is going to be really helpful for you guys to review different step types, as well as the cleaning operations available at each step. All right, moving on to question number seven. Let's say you want to add a custom color palette in Tableau. Which file do you need to modify? And the correct answer here is A, you're going to add your custom color codes in the Tableau preferences file. For question number eight, we need to specify the chart type that uses binned data. In this case, the answer is B, a histogram groups values of a continuous measure into ranges or bins. In question number nine, we need to specify what is the resulting output of this function. The right function is a string function, which is going to return the specified number of characters from the end of your string. So the answer here is C. In this question, we need to indicate what type of join is used by Tableau when showing a visualization with dimensions only, when multi-table data source is related. All right, so when using a multi-table data source with related tables, if you were to build a dimension-only visualization, Tableau is going to use an inner join. So the answer here is B. Thank you guys for watching. Please feel free to share, like, and subscribe to support our channel.